Nobunaga Oda, Life of the Man, called the Sixth Heavenly Demon King, Part 2. Continuing from the first part, we will introduce the life of Nobunaga Oda, the darling of the Warring States period. In this second part, we will follow Nobunaga's life up to Honoji Temple, where he was the leader of the Tenka Fumu, military force under the heaven. It will be a bit long, but please bear with us until the end. Nobunaga's Ideal Nobunaga Oda defeated Yoshimoto Imagawa, Yoshimoto at the Battle of Okehazama and unified Owari in 1565. He allied with Nagamasa Asai of northern Omi by marrying his younger sister, Ichi, and kept the Mino and Saito clans, which covered the northern part of Owari, in check. In Mino, Saito Yoshinaga died about four years earlier and was succeeded by the younger Tatsuoki. In 1564, Tatsuoki was attacked by his vassal Shigeharu Takenaka and the Saito clan was on the verge of internal collapse. He conquered neighboring Mino only two years after uniting Owari and changed the name of Inokuchi, where Inabayama Castle was located, to Gifu in reference to the legend that King Wen of the Zhou dynasty had taken the kingdom of Japan. At the same time he conquered Mino, Nobunaga began to use the red seal Tenka Fubu. This term is often misunderstood, but it does not mean unifying the whole of Japan with military power. At that time, Tenka was limited to the Kinai region, which was under the effective control of the central government, and the character for Bu originally had the meaning of stopping a spear. In other words, Tenka Fubu was a declaration of determination to pacify warfare in the Kinai region and rule with good government in the Chaos of the Warring States period. No other feudal lord would have acted from this perspective. Nobunaga's ideals are also expressed in his Hanaseki in Seal, which is based on the motif of Kirin, the divine beast of good government and peace. Honeymoon with Ashikaga Yoshiaki. The story goes back a little to the eighth year of Airoku, 1565. In 1565, a shocking political upheaval called Eiroku no Hen broke out in Kyoto in which the shogun Ashikaga Yoshiteru was attacked and killed by Miyoshi Saninshu and others. In response to this, Yoshiteru's younger brother, who survived the incident, returned to his former position and assumed the name of Yoshiaki, later Yoshiaki. And while living with the Asakura clan in Echizen, he requested that the feudal lords of other countries help him to go to Kyoto. If we assist the legitimate heir to the shogun's family and rebuild the Muromachi shogunate, we can take real power in the center of the shogunate. Nobunaga, who had brought Ise province under his control following Mino, came forward to offer his services to Yoshiaki. The time had come to make Tenka Fubu a reality. In September 1568, Nobunaga, who had dedicated himself to Yoshiaki, led a large army together with the Tokugawa and Asai clans and set out for Kamigami. First, they defeated the Rokaku clan in southern Omi, then brought Hisahide Matsunaga to their side, and finally defeated the three Miyoshi warlords. Yoshiaki was so grateful to Nobunaga, who was only three years older than him, that he called him Onchichi, father. However, in the first month of the twelfth year of Eiroku, 1569, the three Miyoshi warriors and Tatsuoki Saito attacked Yoshiaki's temporary residence, Honkokuji Temple. When Nobunaga learned of this, he rushed out in the pouring snow with only 11 warriors in all. After confirming that the Shogun was safe, he personally took on the task of building the fortified Nijo Palace, which was surrounded by stone walls. Yoshiaki personally served Nobunaga a cup of sake and thanked him with a reward. Nobunaga shed tears with Yoshiaki when he returned to Mino, and Yoshiaki saw Nobunaga off until he was out of sight, showing to everyone how much they loved each other. Yoshikage Asakura, who had protected Yoshiaki immediately after the Eiroku incident, was not amused. Yoshiaki twice ordered Yoshikage to go to Kyoto, but Yoshikage refused to do so because he knew that if he accepted the order, he would have to obey Nobunaga as well. The first Nobunaga siege. In April 1570, Nobunaga and Tokugawa Ieyasu marched to Ekizen, claiming that Asakura had a plot against them. 
At first, the Oda Tokugawa allied forces had the upper hand, but Nagamasa Asai, who was also allied with the Asakura clan, was caught between a rock and a hard place and chose to betray Nobunaga. When Nobunaga heard the news, he did not take it well, saying, You are lying, aren't you? Nobunaga, upon hearing the news, refused to take it up, but was caught between the two at Kanegasaki, Tsuruga City, Fukui Prefecture. In shock and anger at being betrayed by his trusted brother-in-law, Nobunaga retreated for his life from Kutsukidani to Kyoto, but immediately regrouped his forces and won the revenge battle of Anegawa at the end of June, aided by the tenacity of the Tokugawa forces. However, at the same time, in Setsu, in the west, the three Miyoshi warriors came back to life using Araki Murashiga and raised an army. Nobunaga made an expedition to Setsu in August, and in September, Kenyo of Ishiyama Honganji Temple also raised an anti-Oda army. In addition, 30,000 troops of the Asai Asakura allied forces moved south from the west of Lake Biwa and invaded Sakamoto, Omi, and holed up in Enryakuji Temple on Mount Hiei. In order to defend Kyoto, Nobunaga hurriedly began to pull his troops out of Setsu. Then, Nagafusa Shinohara, a vassal of Nagayoshi Miyoshi, attacked from Awa and Sanuki in Shikoku, and Kenyo also rallied the revolts in northern Ise. I think I'm stuck. I may have reached the end of my rope. Nobunaga, thinking that he might be at his wit's end, managed to escape from the crisis by making peace with the hostile parties. Nobunaga and Yoshiaki broke up. In 1571, Nobunaga sent an army to defeat the Isenagashima Iku uprising, but was met with a counterattack and retreated. He had also urged Enryakuji Temple, where the allied forces of Asai and Asakura were holed up, to make the following three choices in the previous year. 1. Become an ally. 2. Become neutral. Or 3. Burn the temple to the ground but he completely ignored them. Nobunaga, who wanted to break the status quo, ordered Enryakuji to be burned to the ground, killing thousands of monks who had become decadent, shocking the neighboring powers. On the other hand, the shogun Yoshiaki, seeing Nobunaga's continued struggles, grew concerned, wondering if it would be safe to continue working with him, and sent a gonaisho to the various feudal lords and temple and shrine authorities, calling on them to keep Nobunaga in check. The following year, in 1572, Nobunaga, whether he knew of the letter or not, presented Yoshiaki with a 17-point complaint. This can be summarized as, Thanks to the Shogun's negligence, I am losing face. Please work hard. Please work hard. Yoshiaki's ears were pricked, and their lovey-dovey relationship began to deteriorate. Then Shingen Takeda, who was supposed to be allied with Nobunaga, responded to Yoshiaki and invaded the Tokugawa territory of Enne. Nobunaga sent reinforcements. Nobunaga sent reinforcements, but in December, the allied forces of Oda and Tokugawa suffered a crushing defeat at Mikatagahara. In the first month of the fourth year of the Genki era, 1573, the Takeda forces invaded as far as Mikawa. Yoshiaki thought, this is hopeless, and decided to turn against Nobunaga completely, and strengthened his hope for Takeda Shingen. The sixth heavenly demon king, under siege again. The Jesuit missionary Luis Foy wrote a detailed account of the situation in Japan at that time. In a letter to Nobunaga, Shingen called himself Tendai Zashu and declared himself hostile to Nobunaga. In response, Nobunaga likened himself to the demon king of the sixth heaven. The record states, the demon king of the sixth heaven is a deity who interferes with Buddhist practice. Originally, he was a generous deity who would grant any wish. Shingen said, Shingen said, You burned down Enryakuji Temple, didn't you? I'm going to fight to protect Buddhism. Shingen replied, Ah, so I am the sixth heavenly demon king. Nobunaga may have been trying to be humorous, but the impact of his words was so great that the image of Nobunaga as a terrible man took root in later generations. Now, if Shingen attacked, he would be surrounded by hostile forces such as Miyoshi, Honganji, Asai, and Asakura, who would checkmate him. However, Shingen died of illness while on his way to the westward campaign 
and this time, too, Nobunaga saved his life. Yoshiaki, unaware of Shingen's death, holed himself up in Nijo Palace to resist Nobunaga, but was soon defeated. Nobunaga banished Yoshiaki to Tomonura and succeeded in seizing power. Nobunaga did not kill Yoshiaki here, probably because he did not want to be stigmatized as a rebel who killed the Shogun. Nobunaga entrusted the Omisakamoto castle to Akechi Mitsuhide, who had been a vassal of both Nobunaga and Yoshiaki since their arrival in Kyoto, to prepare the way to Kyoto and Izan. He also recruited the remaining vassals of the old shogunate in Kyoto to work under Mitsuhide at the center of the government. In August of the same year, which was the first year of the Tensho era, Nobunaga laid siege to Asai's Kotani castle. Hisamasa's father, Hisamasa, also committed suicide at the end of August, and on September 1st, the main citadel of Kotani castle fell, and Nagamasa Asai committed suicide. Nobunaga had the heads of these three men imprisoned in Kyoto, and their skulls were then lacquered and covered with gold powder to honor and mourn their bravery. The Third Nobunaga Siege From this point on, Nobunaga spent all his time fighting without a moment to catch his breath. In 1575, he attacked Takeda Katsuyori, who had repeatedly invaded the Oda and Tokugawa territories, at Nagashino and Shitarahara, and won a great victory with a strategy that made heavy use of gunfire. Thereafter, the Takeda clan continued to decline. Immediately after the Nagashino battle, an uprising broke out in Echizen, but it was suppressed by slaughtering more than 10,000 members of the sect. In November of the same year, Nobunaga was appointed by the imperial court as Gon Dainagon and general of the right Konoe, and was given the seal of approval as a man of the land. Nobunaga handed over the governorship to his heir apparent, Nobutada, who had been educated to be a gifted man. The construction of Azuchi Castle began at the beginning of the next year and took three years to complete in all its splendor and magnificence. In 1576, Nobunaga attacked the Honganji Temple, which remained a threat. After a fierce battle at the Tenoji Fortress, he blockaded the Kizu River mouth, and Honganji, in need of food, asked Mori, the leader of the Western provinces, to join him. At about the same time, Uesugi Kenshin, who had allied with Nobunaga, made peace with Honganji on his own accord, and Hata no Shuji of Tamba switched sides with the local people. At the mouth of the Kizu River, they were beaten to a pulp by the roar of the Mori and Murakami naval forces, and suffered a crushing defeat. Nobunaga, however, fought back in 1577. He defeated Magokazu Suzuki, Azoka, who had been aiding Honganji, and then had Yoshiaki Ashikaga, who was doing well in Tomo, and Hisahide Matsunaga, who was responding to the Honganji, commit suicide at Shigiyama Castle. The following year, however, Kenshin died suddenly, and the Gokan Rebellion broke out, which was reversed when the Usugi forces invaded the Uesugi territory. He took advantage of this opportunity and invaded Uesugi's territory. This time, Nobunaga broke the Shige by himself. In fact, he put a lot of effort into renewing his military equipment and organization. He organized a directional army and deployed Nobunaga's all-stars in each direction, Oda Nobutada and Takigawa Kazumasa in Kanto to counter Takeda, Shibata Katsuye in Hokuriku, Akechi Mitsuhide in Kinai, Hashiba Hideyoshi in China, Oda Nobutaka and Niwa Nagahide in Shikoku, Oda Nobuo in Aisei, and so on. In addition, each unit was to improve its mobility and coordination, and each unit was to devote its efforts to conquering its respective area of responsibility. In this way, Nobunaga's descent did not stop in the Kinai region, but was spreading his fumu throughout Japan. In 1580, Nobunaga, who had taken over Ujimasa Hojo, the ruler of the eastern part of Japan, made peace with Honganji at the behest of Emperor Shojimachi. The Honganji left Osaka, bringing to an end the 10-year-long Honganji War. In February of the following year, Nobunaga held a large-scale military parade called Kyoto Gomagere at the request of the imperial court. He showed off his overwhelming military power to the emperor and the court nobles and let everyone know that I am the ruler of the land by wearing flashy costumes. When the conquest of Koshu began in 1582 with Nobutada as general, Takeda no longer had the cohesion of the past and was defeated like a spider scattering its eggs. On March 11th, 
Katsuyori Takeda committed suicide. The Kai Takeda clan as warring feudal lords perished. Honoji burns in flames Nobunaga, who was also putting pressure on the Uesugi domain, set his next target as Chosokabe Motochika, who had just unified Shikoku and had Nobutaka prepare for an invasion. Akechi Mitsuhaide was originally in charge of intercession with Motochika, the sister of Rizo Saito, a relative and chief vassal, had become Motochika's stepmother, but the relationship deteriorated due to the planned invasion of Shikoku. In May, when Tokugawa Ieyasu visited Azuchi Castle, Mitsuhide was ordered to serve as his host. During this feast, Hideyoshi Hashiba, who was attacking Takamatsu Castle in Bichu, China, requested reinforcements, and Mitsuhide was relieved of his duties and went into battle. On May 29th, Nobunaga also went to Kyoto with a small group of peasants to prepare for his attack on Mori and to pay a visit to a nobleman on the first day of the month. On June 1st, he presented his famous tea ceremony utensils to the nobles who came to greet him, and that evening he and Nobutada spent a peaceful time drinking sake, although Nobunaga apparently was a lackey and watching a game of Go. At dawn on June 2nd, the battle cry suddenly rose. Nobunaga was reported by his peasants to have been surrounded by an army and he asked, Is Nobutada rebelling? Nobunaga asked. He did not expect Akechi Mitsuhide to rebel. Nobunaga, who had no choice but to fight back with his own spear and bow, was wounded. Nobunaga finally said, This is it. Nobunaga finally said, Leave us alone and run. Nobunaga let the women go and set fire to the temple. Nobunaga Oda, the darling of the Warring States period, died at the age of 49. His body was never found, and even after his death, he continued to play with Mitsuhide. Conclusion, although he defeated Imagawa Yoshimoto at Okehasama, Oda Nobunaga was only a leading feudal lord in the Tokai region, who had just unified Owari. He assisted Ashikaga Yoshiaki to become shogun and expanded his power around the Kinai region. At the same time, however, he was betrayed repeatedly by those he trusted and was frequently besieged by hostile forces. Nobunaga passed through three sieges, but just before achieving his ideal of Tenkafubu, he was betrayed by Akichi Mitsuhide, perhaps his most trusted retainer, and scattered at Honoji Temple. He himself disliked treachery and rebellion, and always acted in the name of the greater good, and it seems as if he was in a trial and error process in pursuit of the ideal leader image. The episodes of Nobunaga reveal a surprising side of him, an idealist with a sense of humor who was easy to trust, contrary to the image of him as a harsh man like a demon king. Thank you for watching the video to the end. How did you like this video? You can subscribe to our channel by clicking on the button above this military decoration. If you would like to subscribe, please do so. Also, please take a look at this video. Thank you very much.